Uncle Mama's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists who have low subscribers and low views, as well as talented artists from around the world. Now, once again, I have no idea or the reason why they have low subscribers or low views, but I'm going to bring it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now, today I'm going to do my best to upload six, six reactions. They are covering from the UK, um, then uh, um, Ukraine, uh, South Korea and Africa and um france and france as well i'm going to bring in france as, onto that it's going to be covering from rock um hip-hop um a bit of kind of a, a, a pop kind of thing and a indie kind of vibe so get ready for that tomorrow is going to be i'm gonna i'm just gonna surprise you i am so excited about tomorrow but you have to wait and see, um, wait and see about that anyway if this is your first time coming over to my channel, please go over to my homepage. Check out the multiple amount of reactions that I've carried out. Start from the um, below and work your way up to the top. There is fabulous, amazing amount of talented artists that I've had the pleasure of carrying out reactions to. And you'll be amazed, I promise you. Once again, if you don't mind, just leaving a comment on any one of those reactions and indeed follow those artists. Go over to their channel, look at their page and see if, you know... Remember, I have not reacted to all of their music. I've only reacted to like one or two. So if you go to their channel, you see multiple amount of more tracks that you can enjoy. And then let me know about these other tracks like you always have been doing. So thank you very much for my subscribers. Going to my subscribers now. Thank you very much to my subscribers who have been continually leaving me brilliant messages, lovely um, links to amazing artists as well. I'm going to give a couple of more shout outs as well. I've got a list down here as well. Um, London. Thank you very much. Um, Liam James, you are absolutely brilliant. Thank you very much. I'm um, Williams, Cody, Nat, uh, Musa Musa, Jeffries, Eugene, how you doing? 2020, AK, 90 million. Um, Maria Bat, how you doing, Maria? Um, uh, we'll see if I can remember any more. Mohammed, um, we'll see if I, all the free Alexes. Um, Luma, how you doing, Luma? Um, Alex Ski, how you doing, mate? I keep this. I, you've been absolutely amazing, Nat. Nat, you have been absolutely brilliant. Please continue sending me those the Masakopedias for Ukrainian music. Um, <clears throat> Jeffrey, Eugene, Alex, um, Alex Ski, um, Luma, um, who else? Justin, um, um, Rolf. Um, who else there is? There's so many. I'm trying to remember off my heart, but I've got the paper right there and I'm trying to go off of that and see if I know how many regular subscribers that I can say off by heart. And it's been absolutely brilliant. I'm going to continue doing that over the current uh, six uploads and just keep on throwing out names and see what I can do with that. So you, you guys count and let me know. And just like I said, just please continue to, to send me these lovely, lovely messages. You guys have been absolutely amazing. If this is... If you know an artist or are an artist, please leave your links over in my community page and I'll check that out. You know that I re react, react, respond to all of my messages. There has been absolutely loads of messages, so please bear with me if I haven't responded back to your message. I will get to it. I promise you that. There is a number of links on my social media platform that you can go over to the about page and you see that. If you don't want to do that, you can follow me on Instagram and Uncle Momo Music Reactions, or you can follow me on Facebook, Uncle Momo Music, or you can follow me on Twitter, Uncle Momo. If you follow me on any one of those platforms, please leave a voice message. I would like to hear how your you know your voice. I, I want to hear you. I've seen your your photos. I've seen um, you know you write and send me messages. So it'd just be absolutely lovely and amazing if you would leave me a message. And if you do follow me on Instagram, Uncle Mama Music Reaction Channel, you will be um, looking at a number of um, artists that I've had the pleasure of carrying out re reactions to their response to my reactions. So that'd be amazing as well. Anyway. Without further ado, my first upload, it will be Tina Carroll, um, to wait it out for you. I think it's to wait it out for you or to wait it out. Um, this has been recommended to me a number of times on the response of the, the Tina Carroll and the um, Julia um, track that they've come, the Hard Kiss and... Um, and Tina Carroll. That was absolutely amazing. It was really heartfelt and everything else. I did send a message over to um, to Tina Carroll and the the you know the management group. So I haven't had a response back from them yet. So hopefully I will do, or I just continue sending the message. I'll upload this one and send this one over to them as well. So you know what we're here for? Great vocabs and a damn good video or Joe music. Can you dig it?
you know that I carried out my first reaction with Tina Carroll and um, the hard kiss Juliana and the contrast between them two was so amazing because there you have um, Juliana, Juliana with doing the you know her rock and contemporary rock heavy metal element and then there's an unknown artist that I don't when I say unknown I mean unknown to me unknown artist Tina Carroll that came in and with them with the you know with the track which they collaborated together it conversated each other and I didn't know where I thought that I was expecting Tina Carroll to follow the same pathway as um, Juliana doing some kind of rock heavy metal kind of element so it was really really a nice pleasure to understand that Tina Carroll is on sort of like the um, Jamela kind of um, element that kind of level and when I was listening to her voice there were certain elements in there because I've heard I, I watched um, the, uh, the well I think about say five or I think it was 10 seconds of her doing the same tr um, track on a live performance and that's when I realized that that's not the reaction that I wanted um, that I should be doing and I stopped it after 10 seconds and I reacted straight away to um, to this one and when I heard the live reaction there were certain elements of I can I can take out certain artists from America um, like um, uh, Shania Twain. She done a riff that was sounding so much like Shania Twain, and um, there was another artist who the one that done the the, the the soundtrack to the Titanic. I can't remember what her name is, but um, she she sounded little elements of that in there as well. So there were certain certain artists and of A list artists that I'm talking about that 
But I wanted that, you know, I was hearing that little riff for oh, that sounded like that person. And I, I heard a little riff there and thought, oh, that sounded like that person. So she's well up there on that caliber um, regarding international value. I know how much she is how much she's warranted over in Ukraine, but let's look on the bigger picture. Where would she stand against like if she went over to America and she said, right, okay, you know, that kind of element, she would stand right up there. Right up there. Um and to, you know, the fact is that Jamelia has done, as you know, um, the Eurovision Song Contest elements. And, you know, her voice is right up there. It's proven. And so, you know that, I mean, has there been a, a collaboration with Jamelia and, Jam sorry, Jamela uh, and Tina Carroll? Um, let me know about that, because that would be interesting to find out. I mean, that's what I would have thought of if there was, any, if there was, any, if there was going to be a collaboration. It would have been between them two rather than Juliana. Nothing taken away from Hard Kiss. She's brilliant and she's absolutely amazing. Um, but I would have seen. I would have thought them two would have been a more of a um, a lovely, you know, doing a lovely. I don't know a lovely co a collaboration in, in with that kind of element. I don't know. And has she done anything with? And why has she done any kind of thing with um, Alona Alona as well? Because that would have been a lovely um, collaboration as well. I don't know how much collaboration she's done, so I'm going to check out that. How many, I've seen one with the Hikers, how many has she done um, with anybody else? Not taking away any from, she does stand on her own two feet. Absolutely does she stand on her own feet. She's amazing. She's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And the video itself, it warrants you to think and study it. I mean, all red, a yellow, um, a yellow budgie or canary, um, and the man's face that's sort of like paint dripping down, and then, all this visual's happening, and you only realise that there's only been about, say, three tops, three instruments being played, the drums and a couple of percussions, and that's it. But, I mean, sorry, the, the guitar and a couple of um, percussions, and that's it, but it, it sounds so much more. I heard things that wasn't even in the song. You know, I heard instruments that wasn't even in there. And then when I took a step back, I thought, realised, well, wow, wait a minute, there's only a couple of instruments that's been playing. So how about that Simpl simplicity has the biggest effect when it comes to um when it comes to music as simple as that and there's a lot of um i don't know there's there's a lot of levels to ukrainian music and ukrainian not yes ukrainian music but to the video itself because you've got some elements where it's all like earthy like you've got um onika or you've got um da habaka brother um or you've got Elena Pash and their videos and that is very kind of i know um tree hugging i i love that the earth um, I don't know how to explain it. Uh, and then you got the hard kiss. You got um, ginger, um, and you got so many, uh, and kind of I can throw in there uh, antitilia, antitilia in there um, as well, where you've got sort of like a a dramatic kind of element of, of high energy kind of things, and then you've got the other twist of it, where it's just minimum is so much. Um, at saying that, um, Auntie Tilla has done a number of minimalistic um, videos which has a powerful message and there. so has Onika as, um, as well. But it's just so much different kind of contrast that you're seeing for in watching in, in a certain effect of a small, a small country just having such a massive volume amount of different kind of music, but still not forgetting um, their, their different, their cultural when they're you know, the cultural elements of their background, where, where they're coming from. And you so, like I said, I said it so many times, you can hear it so many times in their music. And it's just absolutely wonderful to see. And it's so powerful. Every single one of them has got, every single word has a character. Every single word has a, a feeling. In so many um, Ukrainian music, it's not like one word, one word, then the sentence means something. It's absolutely that word is a powerful word next to that word. It's a powerful word next to that word. It's a powerful word. And to com combine together makes a brilliant video. And you sit in the, in the facial expressions, just like Tina Carroll. And she's just absolutely amazing. And it's an honor to be put onto uh, well, for me to put another edition of Ukrainian artists onto my channel. I just don't know which way to go. Do I go the collaboration way to find out how many collaborations she's done? Or do I go and channel in for what, sh what she's about and and focus on, on her? Because any time when she's going to sing a song, I know that I'm going to do a comparison with Jamila. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. But it's really nice to see this absolutely amazing um, talent and... Thank you very much for so many of you have recommended me to check her out. I've checked her out. Mm. I just know your mom. Fabulous track.